This, this is LeBron's homeboy. Ain't nobody gonna respect him. No one is gonna respect him as a coach. Utterly ridiculous. And the fact that this man keeps getting people fired. You got to be dumb. LeBron wanted his homeboys and wanted names. Shit didn't fucking work. Wait, time this out. So we you. blame him, but y'all don't blame nobody else but nobody coach getting fired. No, I'm like, I'm, oh, so those things are kind of, don't you? One well, year. And it the last a year in Phoenix. Don't just get fired every day. I never hear LeBron advocating for some black coach. You can over talk me, but it ain't gonna change the fact that Mike Brown is coached for five years and Teron Lewis is coached for four years and neither one of them got fired. You're acting as if though LeBron ain't, like, I'm it ain't gonna happen. It, it ain't gonna happen. But I'm just saying, saying you say he don't advocate for black coaches. Mike Brown's coach of the year, we got them Sacramento Kings though. And he didn't even make the playoff. You're saying it's LeBron fault when everybody else fall off. LeBron took it to the finals the first year as a Cavs head coach, but hey. You're saying the main don't like black coaches. You saying he don't give him a chance. The tallest glass of dirty boy shoot with some goddamn ice. <laughs> LeBron's supposed to get every black coach a chance, although he gave two of them a chance and took him to the finals. Why is he always crying and shit and always want something then? Because every it's other NBA player crying. crying. You worried about him more than you worried about everybody else. Cry the most. And he cried the loudest. So you gonna sit up here and lie again? Niggas be lying.